spirit of Christmas. Now, however many bands that is, it's exactly not relevant to now, because today's review is of the Proton Pack's previous to last album, Conspiracy 66, which came onto our world uh, a few years ago, a few years ago, on Mum's Basement Records. So on the front here we have a delicious design. A delicious design. The Proton Packs, Conspiracy 66. Look at that design work. Top notch. We have a Mothman. We have one of those planes. Can't remember what they're called. Black Bugs or something. And some dodgy looking fella. With a smoking gun. That's the sort of nonsense we have on here. Um, and there's the Point Pleasant Bridge. Creepy stuff. On the back, we have a fella talking on a blower maybe divulging some secrets to someone someone he might know maybe someone he doesn't know you never know in the world of espionage side a six tracks side b six tracks fine plain as day let's take a look within okay okay we have the band man you see them <laughs> and even though they're in a band, they're not banned from my house. They're dreadfully welcome. There, there are the four of them, and the credits, and on this side we have the band words for the song, uh, investigations, and analysis. Uh, this record is a dreadfully heavy record. It is of high quality. This is the bark version. I believe there's also a red version. Might be wrong, I think there is. This side we have the nuts and bolts of it. We've got the nuts and bolts. We've got the proton packs, the Spiracy 66. Side B, the track name. We've got the, uh, the Mum's Basement logo. We've got everything. Everything is on both sides. All encompassing. Let's take a listen to see if this Italian quartet are giving us meat on the bones. Had enough. I've had enough of not listening to this damn record. I think this is the best of the three Protons Packs albums. What I is heard. This is a very strong album by the Proton Packs. And uh, in fact, I must divulge to you that if you can only afford one side of this LP, if you've spent all of your money this week on uh, Pokemon cards, then good for you. But if you've spent all of your money this week, on waste disposal and equally rotund things, then um, you can only afford one side of the album. Plump for side A. Side A is tremendous from the opening world of this plan cannot fail. The songs are all good on side A. It's not, well, they're all good on side B, but I think that side A is the best side of the album, of the best album by the Proton Packs, and I'm happy to have it as part of my special collection. A collection that I'm going to show off to my neighbours, to passing brides, to hairdressers, stitch merchants, um, uh, rugal frugals, pumpkin dressers, and um, different things like that. So in conclusion, buy it. Mum's Basement Records. Um, yeah, good. And also, if you can't buy it, or if you're just slightly interested, go and check them out online. Of course, you know you can. It's easy stuff. It's easy stuff. There's YouTube, Facebook, all this sort of stuff. Um, enjoy this week. Enjoy your May 16th of listening to Lagwagon. Enjoy being sad because of the passing of um, the very impressive Jack Terry Cloth from the World Inferno Friendship Society. That's what I look like when I'm really sad. Like that. And he's not the only Jack to die this week. 
because the wrestler New Jack also died this week. So it's a bad week for Jacks. Although some people wouldn't give Jack kit about that. Have a great week. All the best. And um, enjoy the height of um, medium-sized frogs. so much for watching my very good video don't forget to subscribe to the very good channel and come back next week for another very good video a video to watch now it's a good video <laughs>